Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. This is Rusty78609 in Central Texas, USA on a Tuesday morning, I think. Hey, Google. Good morning. Hi, Rusty. The time is 6.56 a.m. Right now in Burnett, it's 51 and clear. Today, it'll be sunny with a forecasted high of 78 and a low of 51. Have a good one. I knew she was going to say something else. But anyway, inside of my Casita travel trailer, the fiberglass unit, 17 feet long, about 13 feet inside. I got about 84 square feet of living space. Today is the day after yesterday, the day before tomorrow. It's now. <laughs> anyway, uh, what else we got here? Uh, oh, live and in color. I forgot to say that. I'm reading my script. You'd love this. <laughs> That's it. Anyway, I just like to keep things organized so that I at least get things going right early in the morning because it is early. I don't drink coffee. A lot of you guys do. But anyway, yeah, you get that caffeine boost. I don't. But anyway, hey, Google, what's the temperature in Bangor, Maine? In Bangor, it's currently 23 degrees Fahrenheit. You guys are going the wrong direction. Hey, Google, what's the temperature in Butte, Montana? The temperature in Butte right now is 31 degrees Fahrenheit. You realize you're going to be above freezing today? <clears throat> How wonderful. Hey, Google, what's the temperature in Columbus, New Mexico? The current temperature in Columbus is 50 degrees Fahrenheit. Same as it is here. Yeah, 50 is not too bad. When you're out camping, actually, 50 is cool. When you get up in the morning, if it's 50 degrees, it's cool. You'd love to have a little heater, but it... Usually, uh, when the sun comes up, uh, it warms up pretty quick. So, anyway, what else can I tell you? Hey, Google, tell us a joke. One joke coming up. What did Jay-Z call his wife before they got married? Fiance. Okay. Isn't that funny? Ha, ha, ha. Uh, what else have we got here today? Oh, this after or later on this morning, I'll post a video related to uh, telemarketing calls and robo calls and stuff and how you can really stop them i uh, found a way i'll i did a video yesterday after i got it worked out but anyway so we'll do that and then i'll come up with something else maybe maybe a beer 30 we'll see david gillis good morning he says hey rusty discount tires has a pretty good product but the biggest problem with me and them is they don't do wheel alignment no they don't i think that's important well you know they don't however that is just me and to quote a great american i do me and you do you that's correct i used to say that all the time have a great day my friend keep the faith you too david gillis enjoy your day john b hoist up to sail john b is that how it went uh excellent info here rusty thanks that's on the tires just all of these are on tires cobra john did they reprogram the tps location after rotating uh, Cobra John, you mean the TPMS, the Tire Protection Monitoring System. They don't have to do anything to that because it's just like changing a flat on the side of the road. You just take the tire off and put it back on, okay? Everything, nothing has to be reset. Uh, uh, Slow-Mo 53, those guys run, wearing me out just watching. Yeah, they, they're pretty active, I have to admit. That's a discount tire. Buster M, oh, the smell of new tires. Yeah, the smell of money is what it is. Calvin Wright on tires. Uh, Tyler is a sharp young man. Yeah, he is. He, he ought to do well at Discount Tire. Somebody watches this video from Discount Tire, they ought to keep an eye on him. Because one thing about running any business in the whole world, you got to have good people to be successful. And once you get some good people, you better keep them. Okay? So Tyler is a sharp young man, knows his business. Good questions from the dude who interviewed him. Well, I was just thinking of questions I would ask if I needed to ask. Uh, my Venus Healer, I simply love discount tire, highly efficient and great prices and true pit crew service. Last set of tires, last set of tires I bought from our Cor Corolla were not only on sale, but yielded back to me a $70 debit gift card. How can you possibly beat that? I don't know. They do a good job and they'll, they'll match any price. If you, you bring in an ad or whatever from another supplier, they'll match it. Uh, BZ 10 sec, good Tyler info. Thank you. This is slow mo 53. Hey, Rusty, can you 
you can teach an old dog new tricks but Tyler taught this old dog some new ones today many thanks yeah it is we had I've had some old misconceptions and he corrected me too because we talked for a while uh, uh, Randy Wyrick, uh, when it's time for the rubber to hit the road, who are you going to call? Discount tire, that's for sure. Dennis 78382, sixth. He, he, he's there. He said, that that's more my speed. <laughs> All right. Dertrixa, interesting. Greetings. Greetings to you, Dertrixa. Very good information. Thank you. And greetings from Germany. Dertrixa, thank you for your comment. Todd Dunn, pretty knowledgeable kid. Things haven't changed much since I worked in a gas station that sold and styled, installed tires back in the 60s. The only difference I noticed was that that radials were newfangled fancy tires back then that we didn't sell. You had to go to a specialty tire store to get radials back then. 17-inch rims were also split rims. I hated those things. <laughs> uh, is he lost? They work like a NASCAR pit, car, pit crew. They do, they do, they do. Uh, Petra Olson, Tyler did a great job answering all your questions, Rusty. He's a very knowledgeable and nice young man. I will definitely make sure I head to discount tires when I'm in the area. Well, good for you, Petra Olson. I think he's from overseas. <clears throat> Andy Cunningham, that was happy days. Yep, that was. That was a good series, wasn't it? But, you know, back then they had good writers, you know what I mean? I mean, the, 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 the uh, TV series were were actually entertaining you know now they throw in a lot of crap but i haven't watched one in years uh ralph phillips discount tires here in san antonio's have always been good to me yeah they they've got a good reputation but they focus they're focused they just they, they just sell one product basically tires they may sell a few other things but mainly tires pork chop holy cow the older i get the younger these younger guys look tyler looks like he's about 14 i guess he's older because he sh is sure knowledgeable and wow, Rusty, you put him through the ringer with them shotgun questions, LOL. Yeah, I was surprised. You know, he never stuttered. He went right on down. He, he knows his product. See, that's the key uh, to selling is uh, know your product. I see you 812. Wow, they are actually running. How can they keep up that pace all day? I don't know, man. You got to be young is all I can tell you. <clears throat> I didn't see any old men there. Let me say that. Peggy Parker, what a sharp young man and polite, a rarity these days with that generation. Glad to see it. No, they have a lot of guys like Tyler at Discount Tire. I don't know. They really do a good job recruiting their help. Uh, I see you, 812. 12th. Woohoo, I'm 12th. Yeah, nobody nobody remembers who's second, more or less 12th. Avlisk, my only experience at Discount Tire was excellent in Glendale, Arizona. Well, thank you, Avlisk. Steven. Ew -wee. Uh, Rusty, you need some new tires. I wouldn't wait on that one if I were you. Uh, what? Well, I, I don't need tires yet. He checked them. He said, you know, we, we've got about another, we've got another year. I'll get 50,000 miles out of them. Aaron Costello, Costello, uh, or Castillo, discount tire by far is my favorite place to purchase tires. They have fair prices, well stocked and great services and my favorite free tire balance and rotation for the rest of for the life of the tires, that's a fact. Deborah Van Zant just put a urinal in the family restroom. Single parents need, uh, never mind. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, Jose Alberto, uh, hey, hi, Rusty. He's got a long comment. I'll read part of it. That's an old video I did. Hi, Rusty. This is a particular video dated September 11, 2016. How have you been doing since then? How old are you now? I'm 73, and how is your health? Fine. I just had my blood pressure checked. 125 over 78, and I'm doing all right. Uh, 72. He lives in South Florida. I spent a few years in Arizona. But anyway, thank you, Jose. Enjoy your life and keep your health, babe. That's what it's all about. Lucy Blodgett. Hi, Rusty. What a great video with excellent questions and clear, concise answers. Thanks. Things sure do change, even in the tire industry. Thank you. Yeah, they do. And I, he brought me up to date on several things. This is on the video I did on springtime in Texas. Shelly, nice video, Rust, nice video, Rusty. Great to admire the small things. Thanks for sharing. Yeah, it is. You know, if you look down at the ground, there's all kinds of stuff going on. And then look up at the sky, same thing. Uh, Shelly, walking downtown, burn it. I give you credit, Rusty. Nice to see you doing what you do. <clears throat> People get older and think they ju should just lay around. Nope, not me and obviously not you. Have a great day. Keep the videos coming. Don't you worry. I will because that's how I pay for my travels and I'm fixing to go traveling in about two and a half weeks, <clears throat> almost three weeks. This is on the tiny home, joyous soul. 
Uh, that shower is way too small. Okay, well, they tell them to make you a bigger one. Uh, Rip Snorton, uh, here in California, Discount Tire is, is known as America's Tire. They are, there, they are the best. Bought many sets there. Good for you, Rip Snorton. CDL Lady Marengo, Discount Tires are great. Long-time customer here. I, I, apparently, they have a lot of long-term customers because they're busy all the time. Uh, this is Judy Abernathy. This is on Walking and Burnett. The monuments are very necessary for future generations. I just found a monument in my home state of North Carolina that my four times great grandfather's name was on. What a thrill to see, see it. Anyway, uh, she's been in Texas for 45 years. She turned 74 yesterday. Happy birthday, Judy Abernathy. Uh, anyway, she said she could join the Daughters of the American Revolution in North Carolina. Quite a neat thing. Well, good for you, Judy. Yeah, but as far as the monuments, I have to tell you, uh, the, they have a very small audience. Not very many people stop and read monuments. Uh, I do occasionally, but not many people do. I don't know why they bother to tear them down. Nobody noticed them anyway. Rip Snorton, you're a wise man, Rusty. Thank you. DBK, Debke here, DBK, why? Hi, Rusty. You ought to show us more little towns and interesting sites like your laugh. Uh, well, you know, I, I, I will as I can uh, shift into high. I wouldn't want eight or ten plies on a half ton. It would ride rough. Tyler did a nice job. Michelin hard to beat. Uh, Brigstone's another good but overlooked brand. Yeah, there's a lot of good brands. And like he pointed out, you know, different brands have a, a different market niche that where they're really good. And, uh, yeah, you just have to pick the tire that fits your needs. Tracy Phillips, great video. Rusty, always the smell of a tire. Always liked the smell of a tire warehouse. Hmm, interesting. I used to work at Sam's Club and would do about 30 sets of tires in an eight-hour shift. Wow, that's a lot. This is Wolfgang Hoffman on the tires. Great video, Rusty. We are in Boise, Idaho. We are two days away from picking up our escape. Thank you and cheers. Well, good luck in your in your new RV. Hope it works out for you. Tracy Phillips, great video, Rusty. That young man was pretty knowledgeable and quick to answer. Excellent job. Yeah, I got the right guy, didn't I? This is 69 Xenos 1. I was there this morning, March 25th, 2019. He was at the border wall in Del, or border fence in Del Rio, Texas. This is Kerry Joe. Good information. Thank you, Rusty. Keep moving. You got it. Clint Price, nice interview, Rusty. Thanks for posting it. Yeah, he was really knowledgeable, and that's why I asked. You know, if, the, if you want to be successful in life, <clears throat> one of the things you might want to consider doing is becoming a good asker. In other words, ask. If you don't ask, see, I asked him. I said, would you mind if I did a video and you, I'll ask you some questions about tires and you answer them? He said, sure, go ahead. I mean, he didn't have any problem with that at all because he knew he knows his product. You know what I mean? And, and, you know, that's confidence is what you're seeing. That guy is confident. Uh, da, 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 da. Uh, Jamie Macon, such a beautiful little town. Burn it. Breaks my heart when I see towns like this dying. We've got lots of cute but dying towns here in rural Pennsylvania, too. Thanks for sharing so many fun local videos of your area. Well, the reason I'm doing that because I can't think of anything else to do. <laughs> Liberty 1776 Freedom on Wake Point. Says his, this guy says my testosterone level jumped 200 points with that interview. Great job. You showcased your quick wit and dynamic personality, personality with that young lady. Johnny Carson's got nothing on you. Yeah, he does. He had a, he had a really quick wit. you got to be quick on your feet uh, when you're in front of a live audience. You know what I mean? He did that a lot. So, yeah, and practice makes perfect. Tires, this is Russ Freedom 37. Nice to see a professional as a pro's. To the dis disheveled slobs we have running around here at our local Goodyear. <laughs> Boy, I tell you, I know the feeling. I mean, I go some places, too, and I see uh, the quality of the help, and I'm thinking, yo. But, you know, they don't pay them anything. A discount tire pays a little bit more, and they get a little bit. They get more. This is on the tiny home, uh, over 50, so what? Anyway, he thinks the price is too high. You know, they, th they think I did uh, that I worked for Dirksen, and I don't. I just happened to do a video. This is Great White Sharky, Rusty, excellent educational video. I never really gave tires a second thought. Price, ply, air, pressure, exp expiration, etc. You have made an excellent safety video, and I must applaud you on your taking the time out to hopefully educate others for the safety of others on the road. Very good job. Rock on, Rusty Sharky, fins up. 
Yeah, you know, I did that primarily for the older group because one of the things that happens is, and my mother did it, and I know other people have too, is you don't drive a car very many miles a year. You keep the car for 10 years, and uh, you keep the same tires on it for five or for 10 years, and they're just not safe after about six years. Liz Childers wonder if they can feel nitrogen tires there. I'm sure they can. I don't know. I didn't ask. Uh, here we go. This is on 5G Central some. Uh, Q QSO says you are you are correct that there is nothing citizens can do about 5G. However, anyone who believes 5G or any smart device is good thing is either not paying attention or is not well or is apathetic. Uh, it is known to adversely impact humans, animals. Uh, well, anyway, yeah, there's a lot of controversy about 5G. But one of the things I found out about 5G when it rolls out for Verizon is they will have no there will no longer be any data caps at all. You won't have to worry about data caps or for hot spots or anything. It's going to be completely uh, unlimited all the way from the get-go. Anyway, Scotty Thompson says, cool comment call. Scotty Thompson says, tomorrow on Tuesday we usually go to movies, and on Tuesday because they have the 5 o'clock movies, but the movie are not good this week, so we decided to go to the gym instead on this Tuesday fun fun. Well, enjoy your day, Scotty, whatever it is. Cool video talk about you getting your tires fixed. Well, I got them rotated, Scotty. Uh, uh, Scotty Thompson says, cool video talk. QSO11, got two left. It's the same person, Q, QSO11. Your hands look very young, 73 years old. In fact, you don't have, any, you don't have many wrinkles. Shh. Yeah, I don't. <clears throat> I do. QSO, so I watched the entire vid on something. Oh, here, yeah, he, he, uh, on how to begin uh, something, uh, Simple Life or something. Uh, it says, you watch the video, something about good advice, but then you say if you don't have cash, you don't have any dig dignity. Huh? Are, you are you suggesting that people who are struggling financially, who don't have a lot of money and savings in the bank have no dignity? No. What I'm suggesting is, is if you don't have any C-A-S-H, you do not have any D-I-G-N-I-T-Y, and that is T-R-U-E, okay? Because when you are busted, you ain't got nothing, all right? So if you don't have any cash and you can't even buy food, then you're in trouble. You know that. I know that. And, and I'm not saying these people are, are, are they're idiots or whatever. It's just a matter. I just, I'm, I'm just saying that uh, those people that have uh, cash in their pocket feel a little bit better than those that don't. Okay? And that's what that means. So having said that, hey, Google, tell us a joke. Sure. Here's one of my favorites. Why did the scarecrow keep getting promoted? Because he was outstanding in his field. Yeah, I th they must not have but about a hundred jokes or less. <laughs> and that's it. But anyway, guys, what else can I tell you? It's going to be a beautiful day here in central Texas. It's going to be 78 degrees a day and then 50 in the mornings. And that's what I look for when I go camping. I've been watching the weather in uh, south, southern uh, New Mexico because that's where I'll head first. And, uh, you know, we'll see how it goes. I, I'm not sure how long I'll be gone or, you know, how long the trips. I, you know, I'd love to be out on the road for a few months, but we'll see. I think I've got my mail situation taken care of, uh, M-A-I-L. And so anyway, guys, <clears throat> from Central Texas, USA, in his luxurious, oh, I forgot to introduce Clinton Trump, or Trenton Clump. I'm sorry, this is Trenton Clump. That's an it. That's a bumper sticker with a jalapeno on it that says Native Texan. That's olive oil from the old... Popeye cartoons, that's a miniature travel trailer somebody sent me. Those are organic bananas. And that is uh, Olive Oil's bra, and that is an Eva Dry dehumidifier that helps a little bit inside this small living area. And you can get one at Amazon, but use the Amazon link in the description of all my videos. So with that in mind, thumbs up, carpe diem, adios, bye-bye. Buy anything you want, anytime you want, but if you think about it, do use the uh, link to Amazon products because I get a small commission. doesn't cost you one penny. Some of you are and some of you have, and I do appreciate that very much because that's the enabler. That's what enables me to get out on the road and go do stuff. So uh, what else? Um, you know, drink plenty of water. You know, keep your body hydrated. That'll help you avoid gout, kidney stones, and it'll also help you lose weight because you'll be full of water and you won't want to eat so much. What else? Take deep breaths. 
Breathe in really deep, hold it for a few seconds, and then breathe out slowly. Do that several times a day. Why? Because that relieves stress, and relieving stress lowers your blood pressure. Is that good for you? Sure it is, you bet. And then stretch, 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 swivel, 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 walk, walk, walk. Do something to exercise your body once or twice a day. You'll never regret it. You'll, all, you'll feel better, and you may live a little longer because of it. You may live healthily a little longer. And what else? Stand guard at the door of your mind. Do not let negative Nancy or negative Ned get inside of your head. This is your head, your brain. This is where all those little electronic impulses are, are forming thoughts. So put in good ingredients, okay? But anyway, having said that, thumbs up, guys. Enjoy your Tuesday uh, and uh, carry on. Adios.